cheap, expensive fragrances to wear while you're quarantined. And it starts today with Lalique, but not this Encre Noir that's cheap and expensive, a different one. See, a viewer emailed me and said, hey man, my wife and kids don't like me wearing these fragrances and parfums de Marley, and they, they, they're too obnoxious and they, they get headaches. Can you suggest me something that's toned down so I can still enjoy my fragrance while I'm quarantined with them? I said, I got you, man. So the first title we're gonna say is, why not try La Lique White? It's a little brother to this black one. Your wife and girlfriend will love this, whoever you are. This is a very toned down fragrance. It's so comfortable, you might even wanna make it your signature scent. You can wear it to work. It's a nice, clean, citrusy fragrance, lemon, and it dries down powdery and very clean and easy to wear. And people say it smells like the expensive Parfum de Marley Galloway. And coming right up next, I have a crazy fragrance that smells just like a hidden gem that Gear Lang made that's over $200 on eBay, but this one is way more affordable. But first, let me show you three brand new releases here in the United States. And at the end of this video, please stay. I'm gonna show you five designer brand names of very comfortable fragrances you can wear. Number one, just arrived in the United States, I believe late 2019, it's by Rihanna, not the celebrity. It's a fragrance company. And this one is called Velvet Amber Oud. As you can see, it's a beautiful red bottle. This bottle weighs a pound, comes in a beautiful red box. The sprayer dispenser comes out like this. The box is made out of velvet. It has Opapanox, which is a resin. It gives off a honey, smoky, woody note, kind of like a mirror, M-Y-R-R-H type scent to it. It also looks like a Dolce Gabbana private line. They have one called Velvet Amber Sun, I think, but their lid is round. It looks kind of similar to some kind of high-end niche bottle. I don't know if they're going for that effect or not. Could be. It's very refreshing and easy to wear. Next one is called Musk. It's a white bottle. The Velvet Musk is a light musk that comes out to play with all the other ingredients. It's very nice and refreshing with rare spices and rare woods. And it also has an in interesting note, which is an antioxidant and it's healthy for your skin called Rose de Mosca oil. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. This antioxidant Velvet Oud is a rare wood and spice that gives you a superior elegant feel. And as I tested, this one lasts the longest. All three have average longevity to my nose. Everyone else says five, seven hours. I said three to six hours. It definitely was there from 7 a.m. till noon, distinctively there to give you an idea. And I'm talking about the other two. This one outlasted it. And I did an internet search on Amazon. They're selling these for $69. On eBay, I've seen them for the same price. And then I saw one eBay seller selling for $35 plus $12.95 shipping or something like that. So it's $47. Now I'm gonna tell you guys something. Rihanna reaches out to me, the distributor. They said, can you help us get the word out for these brand new fragrances? They just came out in the United States. I said, no. They said, why not? I said, because I'm looking up right now and my customers don't care about 50, 60, $70. Average per performing fragrances do you they said what if we offer to them lower I said maybe they'll care how much so I'm prepared to offer you you get only one bottle for $49 but that's not what we're gonna do you get all three bottles for nine for $89 so that's under 30 that's the only way we can sell them because the shipping costs so much but when you buy it like that the hidden gem I was talking about by gear Lang. It's called Gear Lang Ohm from 2009. It's an Eau de Parfum Intense. Gear Lang Ohm Intense found for about $189 on eBay. Brand new in the retail box sealed is what the auction says. And for a similar scent cheaper, this is the one we're really gonna show you. It's called Gear Lang Ohm. Found for $32 to $37, depending what fragrance website you go to in the United States. The difference between these two is not the years that they were made. It's simply two different notes this one uses rhubarb this one uses mojito they both have the sugarcane mint this one uses mojito and lime notes what is rhubarb well rhubarb looks almost like a celery stalk but produces a grapefruit strawberry clean cucumber green fresh note with a touch of cilantro or, or something like a coriander leaf giving it that green nice effect and it does smell very good and what is lime? It's a green citrus smell, just like that. So this, when it dries down, it lasts eight to nine hours, by the way. Whereas the 2009, this is a lot darker. 
and wouldn't be appropriate for staying at home and wearing it because it's a lot stronger but it is a great office scent. that's a great scent too don't get me wrong now if those two scare you and you want it even tone down less just so we have closure this is gear lang ohm the one that started it all from 2008 it's not as sweet as this eau de parfum because this has the sugar cane this has florals this one does not but it's a great three to six hour summer fragrance spring fragrance with a beautiful soft sea eyes perfect for non-offensive staying at home comfortable comfortable cozy fragrance five bonuses coming up right up and if you're new here my name's christian o you've landed on best brands perfume this channel we help you smell better for less connect you with other fragrance lovers down in the comments below simply talk about all things fragrances related how could you do that better and easier click on playlist where we have over 250 videos that are very nicely neatly organized please subscribe share and do all that other good stuff if this video strikes in accord with you share it this video has a question of the day the question of the day is to you fragrance reviewer mark to you, fragrance reviewer Scott, and to you, fragrance reviewer Neil, and to you, the viewer, what fragrances do you wear when you're sitting at home and you don't want to offend anyone? Question of the day. And now for your five piece bonus points. fragrances, focusing on comfort and not to be so loud to bother others in your household during these hard times. Number one is called Clinique Happy for Men. It's a bright orange citrus that's very easy to wear and non-offensive. Number two, if you want some longevity, this is the longest one on the list of these five. Polo Red Extreme, a delicious combination of citrus along with some coffee notes and it's very long lasting and unique. It just smells so good. Every time I see this, I want to smell it and it just makes you smile just that fast that's what i love about it now if you don't want it to be so I'm not going to say powerful but long lasting so you don't maybe you just want to wear it you try the polo red rush it's similar to that one but it's a lot lighter it's got some saffron notes in it, it does have a coffee note in it as well and if you want something unique one spray only for this one because you're in the house you don't want to piss off the dog you get Versace Eros, a lemony mint refreshing fragrance, one spray in the house. And one of my favorites that I've been wearing that doesn't, it's hiding under the radar, it's called Urban Hero by Jimmy Choo. It's a refreshing, unique composition. Kind of smells kind of, kind of like Coach fragrance. Has some citruses in it. And it has a leather finish, which I really enjoy in a fragrance. And has a nice crisp apple note inside it. Rack it up, rack it up, I gotta build up the bank to make me a safe house. Shake it up, shake it up.